Hello there YouTube, uh, Digging Any here. Uh, this is going to be a slightly different type of video. Not quite metal detecting, but it does involve coins. Uh, this is also, I'm going to be stacking some silver as well. Uh, mostly junk, simply because if the uh, government fails or a big catastrophe happens, um, where uh, paper money or currency isn't exactly easy to get, like taken out of ATMs or banks or clothes or something like that, and you need to make purchases of food or something like that. Well, I can go up with like five dimes for a loaf of bread or something like that. So, and it's also a, another way of saving money. Um, me and my wife have noticed over the last year that we aren't very good at saving money in the bank because we'll see it and we'll be like, oh, well, we can afford this since we have that money. And we end up pulling it out of the savings and spending it. This way, we still have the money. It's just in a different form. It's not at the bank and it's not exactly easy to get the cash, say, for uh, two half dollars, for example. Uh, you can't just go out to any store and get the full value of a silver half dollar for silver value anyways. Like you would have to plan it out and do something like that. But, yeah, as of right now, I've been stacking for about a month now. I know it's not very much and mostly junk. Most of you are like, oh, what's the point of that? But we all have our different reasons. This is just mine. Right now I have five ounces. Um, this stuff here is what I found metal detecting. I had another silver ring, but I gave it away to a lady when I was metal detecting. She really enjoyed it in the fitter, so it is what it is. Um, this is also a coin collect. And as you can see, I have my first dug 90% silver right here. Uh, I didn't get this on video. I was having trouble with the GoPro at the time with uploading to my computer. Needed to update it. It's a 1964 uh, Rosie. And then uh, just recently you guys saw the unboxing video of the contest I, I won second place in. This is from Lost and Found Metal Detecting. It's a 1948D Rosie. And then I also have picked up this 1916 Merc. It's a plane. It's just got a lot of tarnish on it, but it has a lot of good detail still on it. Uh, that's a plane. And then I also have a 1943D Merc. And all these shiny Rosies are all Ds. And a couple of these others are D's as well. And then this one is a pretty worn 1916, but it's still good. Uh, some other pickups I got was this 1929S Standing Liberty Quarter. Uh, so that's pretty cool. I have wanted to find even just a silver quarter, just metal detecting, but still learning and still working on it. Uh... Then I have these two, I picked three of them up. I gave one to my brother for his collection. Three 1964 MS condition silver Washington quarters. This one's a D, I'm gonna hold on to this. And uh, I'm probably gonna do a giveaway. Probably around Christmas or a little bit after. Uh, also gonna make a secondary video for that. And pretty sure I'm going to have this one as a prize, along with some other coins. And then here's the uh, 1944P War Nickel that I found metal detecting. It's got a lot of tarnish and stuff still on it. But this, uh, for just bullion ounces, I have this Buffalo. This Indian Buffalo from 2013. 
So, wasn't bad. I really like it. Just the sort of generic round, people call them. So, one troy ounce. And then I also just recently picked up this Sunshine Minting uh, one troy ounce with the security feature right there in the middle. I like it because of the eagle. I like eagles. But, um, I'm not going to be one of those stackers for silver who goes out and buys like 30, 40, 50, 120, 200 ounces at a time, like three times a month. No way, Jose. Can't, I don't even make that much money in four months. So, for those people, good for them. Uh, me, I just buy whatever I can afford to save and to put away without jeopardizing my bills or anything of that sort. Uh, does this mean sacrifices for me and my wife? Yes, but it's good news for the long run because if we have a medical emergency or something like that, we can come back here, sell off a little bit or what we need to to be able to pay for the emergency or when stuff hits the fan with the government, if it fails or anything like that, we can be, we have a bartering system already in place. So, those are just a couple of the reasons why I stack, what I'm stacking. I really like the uh, Walking Liberty half dollars for junk. Um, I'm going to be trying to pick up a uh, silver dollar or two. Uh, the American ones uh, in not too long of time but I also have to make sure that me and my wife are able to put that into this uh, so we don't want to end up in a situation where we aren't paying a bill and then we look bad on ourselves so again I don't make terrible amounts of money uh, so Actually, it's getting a little bit harder now to be able to put money into the silver stack here. Uh, holidays are coming up, so people are wanting Christmas presents, and my wife loves Christmas. So she's already starting to make purchases for that. <laughs> and I have to keep reminding her. Do we have money for this? Do we have money for that? Are all the bills going to be paid? So she has to put a couple items back when we're shopping to make sure that we can still afford to live where we are without stressing or having to ask for help from friends and family, which we are very blessed for those who have helped us recently for the situation we are in, but we have paid them back. And we are very blessed that God is being able to give us the knowledge on silver stacking and the uh, friends and friendship that we are gathering at church and all the wisdom we are gathering there so my silver stack probably won't grow significantly fast over the next say four or five months uh, I'm quite surprised I was able to get five ounces already um, just Things people have uh, generously given us for little extra odds and ends that I'm doing at work for different people so they can get out earlier. But it's not too big of a deal. Uh, so here we are with the November 17th, 2014 silver stack so far. And stay tuned for other upcoming videos for just... Not silver in general, but coins. So other than that, keep stacking. Uh, happy metal detecting for those who are my metal detecting followers. And I will see you before Christmas, hopefully. Alright, take care. God bless.